Hey guys, there's no man here. Welcome back to Let's Play Second Hudson. In the last episode, we finished Coach Oliander's basic braiding mind. Okay, anyway, we've got a button in hand, and we're going to go uh, reattach it to my pants because uh, they've been blown right off, baby. Okay, I'm going to close my <laughs> eyes, right? And then I'm going to start to count to a hundred, okay? And then you guys hide. Everybody got it? It's hide and seek, Vernon, not hide and calculus. We've all got it. I got it. You start counting, and then I go hide in that bush. Great. What? Milka, you're a genius. Come on, Duggan. Hold on. This reminds me of a story. It's about counting. Hello? Bad. You guys are good. <laughs> Uh, I actually think you can go around and find them, but I'm not entirely sure where they are right now. Uh, is there another thing over there? There is. No, I don't want to lose this button. Hey. I might not get into Sasha's secret. Oh yeah, that, that's telling me to, to put that button down. So anyway, uh, we do have a map which we can access somehow. Uh, I don't care. Uh, I'll explain this stuff myself. I'll explain it myself. Uh, oh yes. Okay, so there was a map there. Uh, I skip past it because I do that. Um, no, I don't want to lose this button. You guys say that every time I try and. No, I don't want to lose this I'm just trying to pull out arrowheads. This place was built on an ancient Indian burial ground. Actually, I'm not sure if that's true or not. That could be. On sale now in the main store, we have a special on Dream Fluffs. You hear me? Dream Fluffs. Hmm. They're good for you. Keep a pocket full of these for a quick boost of mental health. Eee. There no goes. Passing. But I need to get to Sasha 9's secret lab. Maybe you should have thought of that before. I did think of that before. That's why I'm here now. <laughs> exactly. Now you gotta pay the toll. The toll? One arrowhead. One entire Stand arrowhead. Up. I found this thing. Is that he what you're points talking about? <laughs> yep. That's an arrowhead. How'd they get here? Frankie, the new kid can't be this dumb, right? The camp's built on an Indian burial ground. She is the most horrifying of them all. Oh my gosh. Indians buried their dead here? Ew. I hope not. No, stupid. They buried their arrowheads here. Yeah, of course. They're hidden underground, but they let out a little gas once in a while. Just like... Oh, eyes of spirals. I just realized so that. So if you see any of that stuff, just pull them right out. Like truffles. Anyway, let me have one of yours. All right, whatever. Yeah, take it. Bitches. They're strutting off like they're in the damn place. Fuck you. So if you couldn't tell, this, um... The whole oh, summer camp. Oh, here, oh hello. Can't do the scavenger hunt without a list. Report back to me when you have enough items for your first promotion. Now get. Okay, so we just got the scavenger hunt thing. This is a, a side quest here where we got to go find all these items. It's interesting actually. They're pretty well hidden, and if you're not looking for them, you probably won't find any so by accident I... at least. Hey, where would he go? Hmm. We saw that guy before. How does Julia. that guy get around so fast? Oh, I lost my button. Oh, this guy. I love this guy. How's it going, pal? You, new boy. Seen bear lurking in woods? Nope. Was it you? Giant, hairless bear? Nope. In Russia, bears much smaller. Also more hair. Less lurking. Always eager to wrestle. <laughs> this one, hide and run. I'll let you know if I see anything. Cannot lurk forever, bear. <laughs> well, looking out under this tiny little uh, log. Would probably be the uh, best place to search for it, I'd just say. Um, anyway, so we are looking for the geo isolation chamber where Sasha Nine's secret lab is, was as we've been so carefully telling everyone. Ah, now, whoa! Don't skate down that. This isn't Skate Three or whatever that game is. Hey, it's the king of the obstacle course. Hello. Hey, Raz, you're awesome. You must be a psycho oh, not by now. Yeah, or even a double psychonaut! Ooh. <laughs> oh no, not yet. But soon. Wow. Man, I'd love to be a Those double two psychonaut. Are so nice. Yeah. Yeah, it, it, they, those people, those two get a little bit dark. And if I. Uh, where am I? Oh, I'm over here. I'm just gonna go up there now. I'll talk to him a little bit. But, uh. <laughs> Go jam Oleander's uh, mind mumble. How's it going, guys? Hey, what are you guys doing up here? Uh... Writing cheers! Oh, yeah! Writing cheers! Wanna hear one? Uh... 
Okay. Ready? Okay! When I grow up... Hey, what you gonna be? I'm gonna be the best, just like my mean homie. And when you say homie, whose horn might you be tooting? The mind reading psycho thriller. Oh, you must mean Rasputin. Yeah! Go Raz! Yeah. The thing is, as soon as you uh, walk away from them, they uh, they take out that poison going on there. Anyway. The camp store is in this big uh, building here, by the way, which we won't go to just yet. I think we're just going to keep progressing the plot. Once the camp store, you can buy things like uh, the dream catcher or the web catcher, as it were. Oh, these two fuckers. Fuck you. Just ignore him, Frankie. <laughs> oh, hey. Hey, Lily. Do you know where Sasha 9's secret lab is? Secrets? It's printed on your map. Duh. <laughs> oh, I know uh, Of that. course. I was just curious if you knew where Sasha 9's lab was. Because I do. Uh-huh. I have a secret lab too, it's called my house. Um, it's located at this address. I bet you won't know where it is, it's pretty secret. Uh, let's see, so it is over... <laughs> eh, um, you know, actually I might just quickly check. Uh, let's see here. Okay, so we want to keep going down this path here. Um, the, the hub world, it might look pretty big, and in a way it is, but you don't have to explore most of it for... Um, you know the story once again like if you're just following the story directly you won't see a lot of this game which i really appreciate i love having games where there's more to it especially if you're really enjoying it which this game is most certainly hey, one i enjoy so much kid, ain't you? well i'm doing some advanced training right now as a matter of fact so i don't think new kid is really a name that you want to get too used to say hold on there you're not doing Sasha 9's advanced training that he does in a secret underground lab, are you? Hidden deep within the iron walls of the GPC, where no one can hear you screaming? Why, yes, I am. <laughs> Shakes a lot. Well, nice knowing you. Oh, thanks, guys. Um, anyway. So, oh. Another cutscene. Yeah, there's a lot of cutscenes going on. people on that stage besides you. No, just now. In the woods. <laughs> mm, no. It must have been something else. You don't smell like pond scum. She doesn't even have a nice. nose. You should write greeting cards. There was some sort of shadowy being out there. Lurking. Watching. I know of only one creature who fits that description. It likes to hide in dark places, silently watching unsuspecting children from a distance. Really? Who? You tree sitter! <laughs> what a bitch! I hate her now. I think I was developing a small crush on her. No, I wasn't. Ignore that. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is taking me back to when I was a kid, and then it doesn't at all because I wasn't like that when I was a kid. <laughs> oh. When will you peek into the hole in my heart? Because you just see yourself staring back. Uh huh. What? I mean, he'd see my new boyfriend, James, staring back, <laughs> and he'd be furious at Nils. Who's Nils? Exactly! And anyway, there wouldn't even be a hole, because James fills my heart till sometimes I think it's gonna explode. One time, I made someone's head explode. All right. Well, okay, maybe there's still a little hole. <laughs> Actually, it happened four times. But James All right, they're just gonna keep going. But, um... Essentially, like, I love how all the kids are, like, kind of stereotypes of, of, like, what a lot of little kids were like, you know? Like, some are obsessed with one thing, the, she's obviously trying to be older than she actually is. Uh, anyway, someone's crying, so we'll let them out. Thanks. I thought I was gonna have to eat my own arms. <laughs> You've been in there for, like, an hour. What is this thing? It's a GPC, a geodesic psycho-isolation chamber. Oh man, cool! Cool? Do you have any idea what this does? Something cool? Uh, no. It's a six sensory deprivation tape. A hermetically sealed metaphysical hotbox. It's solitary confinement for psychics. Mm. Nasty. And the coach locked you inside it? Nah, the staff has 
hadn't put any kids in the GPC since the 50s. Bobby threw me in here. Of course. Fucking Bobby. Bobby. should have sold own size or larger only. Why even cooler? Perhaps notice gigantic bear with skin where hair should be? I didn't see anything in there. That's the whole point. Hmm. Just so. Empty now. Good luck, small ones. Hey, wait! I think they've become friends with their brothers or something like that. I love that Russian kid. Um, but yeah, I was just gonna say that, like, it has all the stereotypes of kids except for one, which is what I was, which was, uh, a, a bit of a nerd, to be honest. Uh, if you couldn't already guess. Because all I did all day was draw pictures and play video games. But, you know. Eh. Can I get into this? There we go. Looks like one of the buttons is missing. Curious. Well, I guess perhaps we could put in a button next time on this play quantum. Oh, I'm sorry. Psychonauts! Oh, that might take a bit. Ugh. Ugh. What are we doing next time? I've been Aznet, but I'll see you next time. Bye!